They call me Bogey Smalls. What you what you want to put on it today? I guess they call me uh, Two Putt Shakur. I like to just go for it. See an obstacle, I just got to go over it. You know what? I'm just going to go under. And that always ends me up in some trouble. You hear the palm tree? I thought I'm still on the fairway. You call that the fairway? I tend to be a little more conservative. You brought cash, right? Five dollars, money on the wood. Find myself in a predicament. Don't let them tell you you can't use the three wood off the tee. All right, that's the three wood, baby. <laughs> oh, we're gonna change our name to the Splash Brothers. Good shot. Yes, sir. Oh yeah. How you like that? I'm here to get bogeys, baby. Yes, sir. Oh, I like your bogey better. What's up, man? Still recording? Yeah. Why? Hey, so, why don't you tell the people yeah. what this bogey brothers thing is all about? Well, I mean, it's just all about sharing positivity and fun. Uh, the average way. We ain't real good, but we want to be good, so we're working towards it. So your boy, Bogey Smalls, might be Birdie Smalls today. Let's see how it goes. This part three, left my tee shot right yonder. Very makeable. He's on the dance floor. Right. Nice, nice. Left of everything. Playable. Wasn't the best spot. Hey, you see that? Who said this was amateur guard? Sink that bird, man. So he says I'm good, then he shoots it right at my ball. Good putt. Let's see if Bogey Smalls can make it Birdie Smalls today. I hear birds chirping. Ha ha ha. It's okay. Still, still, make it happen. still a great par. Amateur par. First one of the day. Good job. So now we move forward to the famous hole number eight here at Red Hawk. It's the island green, lakes surrounding it across the bridge to get over to the green about 140 here from the blues I went to the right a little bit it's on the green to the right right above the bunker so you're you're solid nice. it's a long putt for birdie
Here you have the bridge at the famous hole number eight. Yeah, that water ain't looking too clean right now. <laughs> Look at you sitting pretty. It's a nice little divot, man. Thank you, sir. What you doing? Just repairing the divot. You know, the Bogey Brothers, we take care of the course. That's good etiquette, bro. Good job. Now, that's a long putt for birdie. I can't even get the ball and the flag and the shot without falling in the water. That was a good putt. That should be a nice putt for par. Great job, Steven. So we're here at the eighth green. Here at Red Hawk. And Reggie's lining up. And he hits the stick. Two putt Shakur, living up to his name. Now that's gonna be a tough act to follow. Let's see how he approaches this par, this par putt. Roughly about six feet away. It looks good. Is it enough? Bad line. <laughs> but that's a good bogey. Bogey. Brother. Brother. Although I did not land on the green off the tee, I was still able to get away and escape with the par. And uh, I'm feeling really good. I think I'm down going into the ninth hole maybe by four, maybe by five strokes. I'm not sure. But... Anything can happen. I'm just gonna keep fighting to the end. Put the pressure on. How much are you losing by? I was losing by three on the front. I think I'm losing by seven. Seven. Yeah. Okay. So you got two holes to make it up. Think you could do it? No. Okay. No way. So I concede. I concede this one to you. Next week, better luck to me. You know what I'm saying? So how much money do you owe me? Five. Okay. All right. Sounds good. Sounds good. How much money I'm gonna pay? How much money are you gonna pay me? <laughs> We're gonna have to double this up next week. Carry that debt over. So we're here at the 10th hole. Reggie's tee shot has went into the hazard. I don't even know if this is legal. Maybe one of you guys could tell us. But Reggie's gonna play it to avoid the penalty. So he's decided to take a drop smartly and because he's in the water hazard he'll just play a drop right here going for three if we're not doing something right you guys let us know in the comments below
Well, two putt, how'd it go? You know what? It was my personal best. I finished uh, 107, which is pretty normal for me, but it's not normal on this course. This is a really tough course it's from the blues. It's a long course, a lot of hazard. Ended up shooting 107, so I'm happy with it. But my man, my man beat me by five strokes, 102. All right, 102 out here. Now I ended up blowing up on the last hole and getting a quadruple bogey. I had a shot at breaking 100. If I would have just bogeyed the last hole, but you know how us amateur players do it. You can see that it's getting dark, so we didn't even get to film the 18th hole, but we had a good time. We finished out the course starting at five, so if you start at five on, at Red Hawk during the summer, um, you know, to beat the heat, you can finish the course. And uh, stay tuned for the next episode of the Bogey Brothers. Yes, if you have a course that you'd like to see us play, Go ahead and uh, recommend it down down below, and we'll try to get it in, and we'll give you a shout-out. Bogey Brothers coming to a course near you. There you go.